So in this video, I will uh, describe how to get started with Autogen Studio. Uh, Autogen uh, is um, agent framework created by Microsoft. Um, so you can create your LLM agents. Uh, and uh, in the project here, if you go to Autogen Studio, you can run install and um, it will then create a Docker container for your Autogen Studio. Uh, so you can just click here and then you should uh, end up in um, in Autogen Studio. Um, so if you go to Team Builder uh, and the default team here, this will be available for you. You can see here that there is a, uh, a test uh, you can run here. But if you, if you actually run this test, it will not work because uh, and as you see, this goes to GPT 4.0 Mini, so you need to have a, uh, an API key for that, which of course you can use if you want to. But if you want to run the um, Alama server instead with this, you first need to go into the gallery, uh, go into Edit, and here you need to search for Mistral. Um, you will actually, uh, I have already changed to this, so. Um, I have, uh, it will say granite here instead. But if you search for Mistral, you will you should come here. Uh, and here you can, uh, this is under models, under different providers. And here you should change the label if you want to change the name, uh, but also change to the, the model to, to um, what you have, want to have instead. And in my case, I selected granite, granite here, dense 2B. Uh, you also need to change the base URL here it says localhost something, to uh, host.docker.internal11434, uh, which is the Olama uh, endpoint, and via for using the uh, OpenAI API specification. Uh, host Docker, that, that's because we are running this uh, on the Docker. So if you're running it locally, like on a Mac, you should have localhost here instead. Um, for some reason, also, it uh, requires you to have an API key. So you need to add this row, API key, but we actually don't need it, so you know you can write whatever there. No key needed. I had it here. Uh, so if you have set your model, which is one you should have installed on your Llama server, uh, and you point this to the Llama server instead uh, and add this, no key needed. Uh, you just need to press save changes here. And then you can see that that changed from Mistral, which it was in uh, previously, and then now it says that you have your model. Then you can go back here to your to your model here again and go open up the models, drag in your granite model, save the changes, and then you can um, write uh, some function. Well, this uh, actually uses the calculator tool. You could, you know, write something that uses the calculator tool um, to get the answer that you wanted to have. Um, which is 200, 220, yeah, so 220. Um, and now you see that it actually runs towards the um, GPU here on the Llama server to, to use this agent. Uh, yeah, so that's how we, and then you can, you know, you just uh, copy your, some other agent here and you can start using just re replacing uh, uh, the models with, with your model instead uh, for the ones where you want to. Okay, you probably need to, oh, okay, yeah, so. And then you can start running these. Uh, so then you have an Autogen Studio that works with your Olama uh, local LLM.